WREG News Channel 3 at 430 starts now. New at 430, giving young men a shot, a chance to make it in life. President Barack Obama is launching an initiative to boost young minorities. It's called My Brother's Keeper and will focus on critical challenges and risk factors young men of color face every day. As WREG's Michael Quander explains, people here are hoping the effects of this national program will be felt right here on the streets of Memphis. Didn't know it until, until really now. Charlie she Caswell knows a thing or two about going down the wrong path. I'm from the streets. I, I grew up in the projects here in Memphis. I dropped out of high school. But he didn't give up, and now his eyes are set on the future. This father of six is making a difference in young men's lives right here at home with his program, the Range Line Community Development Corporation. Most importantly, engaging our young men to, to teach them and train them to how to be better fathers. President Obama's newest initiative, My Brother's Keeper, aims to help young black and Hispanic men succeed. We need to change the statistics, not just for the sake of the young men and boys, but for the sake of America's future. Several groups across the country have answered the call to give money and will dish out a total of about $150 million for the program. It'll fund everything from job opportunities to education and juvenile justice reform. And this is needed. You know, this is totally different and totally out of the box. I spoke with Tennessee State Representative Antonio Parkinson no, no, earlier today. No, no. He hopes the effects of the initiative will be felt right here on Memphis City streets. With the fact that these uh, African-American, young African-American males, you know, are more likely to be uh, murdered, uh, more likely to drop out of school, more likely to, to come out of school um, lacking proficiency in, in reading and, and comprehension. Problems people like Caswell see every day day and why the president is trying now to hold on to his brothers. In Memphis, Michael Quander, WREG News Channel 3. And just in case you're wondering, the program will be launched in four stages. The first step is getting information together for a public website. A task force is expected to have that part done by next month. And again, through the My Brother's Keeper initiative, the White House is partnering with businesses, nonprofits, and foundations to address disparities in education criminal justice and employment. Groups have invested 150, uh, uh, 150 million dollars in the program and have pledged to invest another 200 million dollars over the next five years. We're following breaking news in the case of Holly Bobo.